please welcome Dave Grohl and Taylor Hawkins. From ragtime to space rock, opera to funk, punk rock to arena rock, there were no boundaries to what Queen could do, or would do, for that matter. Their legendary performance at Live Aid in 1985 with no lights, no sound check, no frills, and only 20 minutes on stage showed the world how to turn a huge stadium into a tiny, sweaty club. Not many bands, not many bands are graced with four hit songwriters. Brian May, We Will Rock You. Roger Taylor, It's a Kind of Magic. John Deacon, Another One Bites the Dust, that. Eh? Freddie Mercury, Bohemian Rhapsody, We Are the Champions, Killer Queen, Crazy Little Thing Called Love. Freddie was a true star, the consummate entertainer, one in a million, and never, ever, ever to be forgotten. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is our unbelievable honor to present to you Queen as the next inductee into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Ladies and gentlemen, Queen. Thank you. We're, uh, this is like getting a PhD. Um, we're very overwhelmed and delighted to be here. Uh, we've had a lot of ups and downs in our career. And this is certainly a a big, big up. Uh, it means actually more than all the Grammys we never got. And, uh, and uh, it's just great to be here in New York uh, for, after all this time. And uh, I'll hand you over to Brian. Well, ladies and gentlemen, uh, <clears throat> and members of the board, thank you very much for voting us into this really totally illustrious company. We feel very proud. Thank you to the people of America for taking us uh, to your hearts over the last 30 years. And um, thank you to Taylor and Dave for making us look cool tonight. We're a little sad that uh, Freddie and John can't be with us, but they both send their love. And um, we have a little surprise for you. And we okay. hope you don't mind. Th this is a surprise, but Freddie's mother, Jer, is here tonight, and we'd love her to accept his award in place of him.